This video is going to tell you a little bit more about creatures that live in the soil. Soil for the growth of plants and the value of growing your own vegetables. Creatures that live in the soil. There are many living organisms present in soil, such as bacteria, fungi, and algae, to name a few. There are also a wide variety of larger soil fauna, such as mites, earthworms, ants, and insects. And then there are larger organisms, such as burrowing rodents. Here we have a few images of bacteria and fungi in the soil and they all serve their purpose but we are going to concentrate on creatures that live in the soil so on the next slide we will look deeper into that there are many different types of animals that live in the soil soil is a living dynamic resource it helps grow food, fiber, and fuel. However, none of these processes can truly be carried out without the help of animals. For example, turtles, gophers, burrowing animals, and insects all live in the soil. Soil condition is very important to animals for many reasons. These larger animals depend on soil for protection. The soil protects them from weather and predators. One special animal that is commonly found in the soil is earthworms. Earthworms are nature's plough, active in turning, mixing and aerating the soil. The burrows of earthworms act like large pores that allow water from rain and melting snow to infiltrate into the soil instead of running off and causing erosion. Ants are also amazing creatures that live in soils. They make some awesome tunnels with areas called chambers that act as living rooms and kitchens. Workers in ant colonies are constantly building their nests to accommodate their growing numbers. While they do this, they make pores in the soil that help plants get air and water for growing. The most important part of soil for people and animals is topsoil. That is the soil in which plants grow. The roots of the plants stop the wind and rain from taking the topsoil away. Plants die when there is too little rain or when there is a fire. They also die if there is too much rain. If there are no plants, the topsoil washes away in the rain or the wind blows it away. This is called erosion. People also cause soil erosion. If we do not look after the soil, it cannot feed the plants that grow in it and they start dying. As a result, soil gets washed or blown away. The value of growing vegetables. One of the benefits of enjoying garden vegetables is a reduced monthly food bill. You can grow organic vegetables for a fraction of the cost in the stores. Get outdoor exercise. Gardening is a physical activity and pulling weeds, planting and digging can burn up to 400 calories per hour. What types of vegetables can you grow in your garden? Do you think they'll taste better in your garden? And why do you think so?